For millennia, farming has been humanity's most enduring partnership with the Earth, dependent on sunlight, fertile soil, and above all, water. Yet that covenant is under strain. The planet is warming, droughts are intensifying, and global demand for food is rising faster than ever before. Today, traditional agriculture consumes nearly 70% of the world's fresh water. One third of all arable land has been degraded in just four decades. And as crops travel thousands of miles through vast supply chains, as much as two thirds of cross-border produce spoils before it is eaten. If we hope to feed a growing population without exhausting our resources, we must rethink how food is grown. What if farming no longer required soil at all? What if the key to future harvests lay in the element that sustains all life itself, water? The first modern story of hydroponics, growing plants without soil, began not in field, but in space. During the 1980s, NASA's Controlled Ecological Life Support System, or CELSS, experiments sought to design whether astronauts could cultivate food on long-duration missions. Scientists discovered that by circulating water enriched with essential nutrients, plants could thrive in closed loops with extraordinary efficiency. Those trials proved that growth is not bound to soil or even to Earth's gravity, only to the precise delivery of light, water, and minerals. The lessons learned in orbit would later transform agriculture on the ground. In a hydroponic system, soil's role as a nutrient reservoir is replaced by direct precision. Plants rest in inert materials such as coconut fiber or rock wool, or sometimes none at all, while their roots are bathed in a carefully balanced nutrient solution. It functions much like an intravenous line for plants, delivering exactly what they need when they need it. Freed from the effort of searching for sustenance, the roots remain compact, disease is minimized, and the weeds are eliminated. The result is cleaner produce that grows up to 50% faster than conventional crops and can be harvested year round. The resource savings are remarkable. Hydroponic farms can operate using 90 to 98% less water than conventional agriculture. Facilities such as Howling's Nurseries, sometimes called the space shuttle of farming, produce up to 20 times more food per acre while discarding only 2% of their yield. Because these systems function in closed environments, they also reduce chemical use by nearly 98%, preventing runoff and preserving surrounding ecosystems. These are not marginal improvements. They represent a fundamental leap in how humanity can grow food under the pressures of climate change. Behind these gains lies an intricate web of sensors and automation. Modern farms employ computer systems to regulate temperature, humidity, carbon dioxide levels, and nutrient flow with scientific precision. The next generation of facilities will be AI-managed ecosystems. Machine learning algorithms will interpret data from thousands of sensors, adjusting conditions in real time to optimize growth. Some operations already follow entire farms to be monitored and controlled completely remotely from a phone. This fusion of biology and technology is no longer theoretical. In Singapore, a nation that imports more than 90% of its food, vertical farms now rise amid skyscrapers as part of the country's 30 by 30 initiative, which aims to produce 30% of its nutritional needs domestically by 2030. Innovation has become a matter of national resilience. The benefits extend far beyond efficiency. In urban food deserts where fresh produce is scarce and expensive, small hydroponic farms can supply neighborhoods with affordable, nutrient-dense food. On just one-tenth of an acre, a vertical farm can feed around 100 families each week. Because produce is harvested locally, it retains its flavor and nutrients, avoiding the up to 50% loss that occurs during long-distance transport. Each head of lettuce grown nearby means fewer trucks on the road, lower emissions, and a smaller carbon footprint. Hydroponics offers not only sustenance, but independence, the ability for communities to feed themselves regardless of weather, season, or soil. Innovation has always been humanity's answer to constraint. Hydroponics turns scarcity into opportunity, proving that science and imagination can coexist with nature rather than deplete it. The technology is here, the evidence is overwhelming, and the mission, as NASA once framed it, is not simply to grow plants, but to sustain life. We once believed farming required dirt. The future is showing that all it truly needs is water, light, and human ingenuity. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and drop a comment below. As always, thanks for watching.